Stars, celebrities, and politics taking center stage at the music industry's biggest night of the year. The 60th annual Grammy Awards were in New York. KNBC 9's Rachel Sanchi talked to Entertainment Tonight's Kevin Frazier to get the full recap on last night's awards. The Grammys are in the books. There's certainly a lot to talk about. Kevin, thank you so much for joining us. First up, seems like everyone's talking about Bruno Mars and Kendrick Lamar. What did you think of their performances and their many awards? Well, I will say this. Bruno was the big winner of the night. He took home six Grammys, including sweeping the big three categories, record, album, and song of the year. And he had the most infectious performance of the night when he and Cardi B hit the stage to do finesse. Now, Kendrick Lamar set the tone. And once again, Kendrick is the guy who, when you need someone at the Grammys to wake everyone up, and when I say wake as in be woke, he did it again. He hit the stage and his performance was electric. It was also a big night though for the Me Too and Time's Up movement. We saw some really powerful gestures supporting that campaign. What stood out to you? Well, I, I have to say, um, Janelle Monet's speech was fantastic, and I thought there were a lot of gestures. Everyone wearing the white, um, white flowers on the carpet and during the show, but the performance of the night had to be from Kesha. When Kesha did her hit song, Praying, flanked by six other women, six powerful performers on the stage with her, it was a beautiful moment, and it sort of encapsulated everything that we've been talking about in this country and with the Me Too movement. Absolutely. And you mentioned Janelle Monet, you know, one of our own, a Kansas City native. Yes. One last moment I want to talk about that's kind of gone viral. Blue Ivy just stole mm -hmm. the show. I got to tell you something. I couldn't stop watching her because I saw her do it the first couple of times. I mean, she was doing it all night long, but I'm sure they're having a good laugh at the house today as they look at how that moment has gone viral.